pleased to hear with the performance of the squad tonight? Oh yeah, I'm delighted. Obviously, it was um, really important to you know cement some of the stuff that we've been working on in pre-season. So it was good to get a, a result away from home against a really, really good team. So it's a good benchmarking opportunity to see how much we could transfer and. To a man, everyone aimed up. You know, they all rolled their sleeves up on what was a pretty grotty night, where it wasn't going to be pretty, and it was all about winning the arm wrestle. So we're absolutely delighted to get home tonight. Good to see some stand-up performances from the youngsters as well as some of the more experienced members of the squad. Yeah, I think that we, you know, we now we're trying to demand a, a level of effort and uh, of unseen work, and. Uh, I think we're seeing a little, we saw a lot of that from everybody, which was great. And then you, you add on some quality and some high profile moments and some people that are learning their trade. And you know, the back three boys were under a lot of assault airily, but you know, they've come up on, on the whole really, really well, got us on the front foot, kicked well, and, and we, you know, we just squeezed and squeezed and squeezed. And, and I'm, sh I'm not sure if uh, people that have watched this realize how poor the conditions actually are here. And, and we've done exceptionally well and found a way to win in, in very, very difficult conditions. So that's also going to be a benefit for us when uh, when the internationals come along, that these young players have now experienced that as well. Pleased to get a win on the board, but are you glad you didn't get a bonus point? <laughs> well, we're always greedy. We want it all. So, But the, the, the encouraging thing is, from a team that um, you know was inconsistent last year, the first thing that the captain said to me was that he was disappointed he didn't get a bonus point. And that shows probably the attitude of the group, uh, that they are hungry to improve and hungry to, to uh, work hard and keep improving. And as a result, then those sort of extra little bits of the cherry on the top will come, I'm sure. But it's a good start for us. We need to reflect on what's happened, get ready for Ulster, because another big challenge coming next week against another very good side.